Chapter, Chapter two. 2. It was getting harder to find animals for my experiments, but I still Ew. knew one I could get access to easily. Um? I told, I told Lyric I was making her a clock, but she wasn't interested. She was too busy playing with her stupid bird. Oh, you must be Lyric. And I'm... Um. Me. <laughs> well, one of us is a worrying person. <laughs> yep. 1932. Oh, hey! It shows the solution of the previous puzzle. Next to the... Yep. Like, at the, the train oh, station. Yeah, it does. Train stop. It's funny. Out of service. Okay. It's crossed out. I guess maybe in, in case you come back to this game and get really confused? Yeah. So we have a new solution. The well got replaced with another building. That's... scary? Uh... Yeah, like a good old uh, trombone store or whatever. <laughs> I don't know, what do you call the That's circle? A... It's a bassinet? What is it? What's it called? Uh... Boghorn Leghorn? <laughs> Gabriel's Horn? But no, not that either. Uh, I'm gonna call it Toot Toot. Let's go into Toot Toot. You wanna go into oh. Toot Toot? Let's go to Toot Toot. I've got the little wind-up toy in here. Uh, oh, this is the post office. Or, as it's known in Danish, the post breakfast. <laughs> I got some shit that's all scrolled up that I can't do anything with, and I can't actually do anything with anything in this room. Uh, I have four dials, and each of the dials has four, like, clock hands, but they're all the same. And I can slide them, each of the four of them, into any configuration. There's a button under each of them and a number, so I'm guessing these are, like, combination locks to P.O. boxes? If this is a post yeah, office? Yeah, that must be it. So, oh, I bet this is how I hand stuff to you. Like, I probably put stuff into the post office box, and then you open it on the other side to receive it. Do you work there? I have no idea if that's true or not, but that's what I'm I'm hoping happens in this huh. game. That seems cool. I wonder if... Do you have any information about how to open these things anywhere? No, I probably don't... I, pr I can probably mm. only give you things on this side. You probably, probably have to go somewhere else yet. then for that. Exactly. Exactly. Raven's Clocks is once again closed till 9. I mean, 3. Okay. Let's see. You want to go to Raven's Clocks first or the house? We can just hop in the house. Okay. Because it's already available. There's like a paper cut style fire in here. Ooh. Like South Park. Okay, I got a, I got a message from Amelie. It says, I left you something downstairs. It will be my greatest invention yet. Play our secret melody and I'll open the door. That's a worrying sentence. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anyway, I have a I have a series of six bells. Underneath each bell, it's the name of a built of a room. So it's like kitchen, front door, study, music room, office, dining hall. Oh. So we'll need to find like a floor plan, I guess. Are you the parasite? <laughs> uh, apparently, I we already knew that. I though. just found that I can scroll down through the floor once I open the door. Oh, you can. Oh. I've unleashed a rope. It really yeah, well. I like you did with the two area. kittens you found in the pantry. Oh. Is Amelie a murderer of animals? I, I think I've got some problems to deal with. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a little... Oh, oh, I just caught a lizard in a trap. Oh, it's dead now. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and, and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. It was... It put that across the footprints as it ran across the wall. It gave me letters. Oh, everything I do is giving me letters in this room. Okay, that's cool. I've been working it's... on this iteration for what? Oh, okay, it's all, it's all it all formatted into something legible now. I've been working <laughs> on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like to keep it safe for me. I'd like you to keep it safe for me, Lark. Look after it oh, really hey, well. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. You said the study. Yeah. Are the are are the letters that you're finding in some sort of order? Uh, they all just they all uh, the parts of the environment were puking messages everywhere, and they've all now assembled into the order. You know, once I got them all, my favorite part of playing asymmetrical puzzle games, and I don't know if this is a universal experience or if it's just with you, but hearing somebody else describe the environment. <laughs> it's so fucking funny to me, right? Because you get this, like, 
<laughs> on my end, I have no clue what you mean by the room is puking letters. And on your end, if I don't watch it, I'm like, oh, that's actually way more mundane than the imagery evokes on my end where I'm just like, that sounds disgusting. Some of that Kanan Lynch co-op stuff. It's fantastic. Okay, so see if you can arrange them into some sort of order. Well, I think they are in an order I've... now. Okay. Because I've been working on this iteration right. for one year now in the study. I'd like you okay. to keep it safe for me, Lark. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. Pretty sure I'm going to murder you and, like, vivisect you. Yeah. Okay, so you said study, and then it was supposed to keep it in the safe? So I guess that might be it office. Just says keep it, it just says keep it safe. Okay, what does it say after that? This, this iteration Entry? is in the study. Keep it safe. Look for look look after it really well like you did the two kittens found in the pantry. Okay, so that in might five, be kitchen. In five years I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. Okay, so that's dining hall. Alright, I guess I'm going to try the order of study, office, kitchen, dining hall. That didn't work. Where are you getting office from? Uh, safe. So the other two things that I... Well, it's like I said, it's, it just said keep it safe. There is no safe. Okay. So maybe just study, kitchen, dining. Yeah. No. Nope. Pantry? Well, I guess pantry in the ki could be in the kitchen. Yeah, definitely. So my options are, once again, kitchen, front door, study, music room, office, dining hall. So yeah, it I seems guess... to just mention study, pantry, dinner table. Okay. Maybe we need to look for more clues, then. Maybe we don't have enough here yet. Maybe it's about the chronology. The kittens are in the yeah. past, so maybe it goes pantry, study, dinner table. Okay. Nope. Hmm. Well, so there's six rooms in total. We have the ordering of three. This game really enjoys its symmetry, so maybe I need to find the other three. Maybe there's, maybe there's another part to the story. Maybe. That we need to piece together still. Shall we pop over to uh, Raven's Clocks? We haven't uh, been there yet, right? Yeah, we might as well. I don't see much else to do here necessarily. Ah. So it's time to spoop. Get out of the game for a moment there. <laughs> Now the game's not recording. Please record. I'm gonna keep rolling. Yeah. No, it was okay. Just, I'm gonna. It was just. Not I'm gonna leave a the mark. Game in OBS. It's like, please. I'm. A, I'm gonna leave a timestamp for you to say that this. Uh, we started having technical problems at 34 minutes in. Uh, we're good. I just, okay. had, to turn on, I just had to turn on display capture. Okay. Cool. Raven's uh, class. Pick it up. I had to spin for a while. <laughs> spin with me, Keith. Spin Do with not me like remove we did these the tools. I will work <laughs> when the clock shop is closed. Amelie. Oops, that's her voice now. <laughs> I have. Okay, so I have a painting on the wall that I assume is of Amelie, who has a raven on her shoulder. Amelie is not looking at me, the raven is. Mm. This game's a mood, man. This game is <laughs> such a weird aesthetic. <laughs> I have a raven in my room right here. Oh, and I, okay. and I have a letter. I. That, I, have a, I have a letter, an apprenticeship letter that says, Dear Amelie, I am pleased to inform you that you have been chosen as my new apprentice. Your experiments with time extractions are truly groundbreaking. I agree that our short lifespan is deeply unfair, especially for people like us who keep improving the world pushing it forward. 
I am looking forward to helping you with your experiment in Switzerland. Yours sincerely, Clarissa Shar, Master Watchmaker. And it's like, straight up like, wax sealed and shit. It's framed on her cute. wall. This feels very much like an Edgar Allan Poe kind of style thing. Brothers Grimm. I, I don't yeah. know, it's, it's feeling very fairy tale, like, grim, yeah. grim darky. It's just a white raven, just in my room. Yeah, uh, like, ravens and like... I mean, obviously, Amelie's got some major, you know, murdery, killy animal type things. So maybe that part's not quite as cute. But overall, mm. it's <laughs> building to an aesthetic. So it's... I have a letter in this room that I that had no content on it. It just contained a key. And then I found another key that was sitting on the table. So I have two keys now. And that's a lot that's of keys. kind of weird. Those are good yeah, number of keys. And... Usually you don't get multiple keys at the same time in an escape room. So maybe I don't know they, what that's about. Maybe you stack them together into a better key. Ooh, maybe. That doesn't <laughs> make any sense, but okay. I also have a box to Lyric that's locked. I can't, you just, I can't open you, it. Th those are flawed keys, so you gotta put the three flawed keys oh, in the Haradra cube. I don't need the Haradra cube <laughs> in order to get a regular key. Um, I think we should go back to the post office. What I, I'll repeat what my note says, just because I find it interesting. It says, do not remove okay. these tools. I will work when the sh clock shop is closed. Which, like, interesting. We, so, we I think if you remove closed. the tools, if you remove the tools, then make it closed, I bet anger happens. Anger? Okay, I don't think I can really remove anything, though. But it does seem to be, it does feel like it's encouraging me to, like, make them, the clock shop closed again or something. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to make it. I removed some things from my shop. Maybe I should make it closed on my end. Oh, and piss them off. Maybe. Okay, the store should be closed. Okay, the store is closed on my end now. Hmm. Oh, I have a key. I was able to unlock the store after hours. Oh, you're Ooh. breaking in, you punk ass. You're gonna hate what popped up on the desk, by the way. <laughs> what popped up on the desk? A book that says Horology, and another book that says Gemstones. Oh, thank God! I thought you were, I thought it was gonna be a shark. <laughs> it's the Horodra Cube. There's a <laughs> there's a box on my desk. There's a book on horology and there's a book on gemstones. This is the Herodric Cube. Lairk had the fucking Herodric Cube the whole time. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'm gonna read. Foretold. I, so... Uh... Okay, gemstones look like it's part of a puzzle. I'm gonna read horology because this looks like lore. So the horology book used, is written by C. Shar. Um, did you say that there was a character named Clarissa? Uh, that's the person I had, that I had an apprenticeship with. Okay, Clarissa. Or one of us did. <laughs> and her last name is Shar. S H A R. Oh, S C H A R. Okay, so she wrote the book on horology, which sounds like I'm insulting your mother. <laughs> your mom mm -hmm. wrote the book on horology. <laughs> anyway. Wow. Okay. Accuracy. Through multiple studies, Miss Shar figured out that a timepiece would be more precise when using only quartz in the channeling plate. I'm gonna make a note of that. Uh, and then there's a diagram of a channeling plate, which kind of looks like a little fan. I'm assuming that's just there for flavor. We're finally not playing then we have... satisfactory, and the quartz oscillators are still following us. <laughs> oh my god. And then we have um, uh, a, a note written in the margins by Amelie that says, I think this sequence will be more accurate with the additional benefit of storing time. The tiger's eye should be the left of the quartz. Okay. Uh, actually, before I write anything down, why don't I just uh, read through the whole thing? <laughs> These yeah. marbles are probably a tiger's eye and a quartz. Yep, the tiger's eye should be the left of the quartz. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. The ruby must must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. I don't have a malachite. I only have a quartz, a ruby, and a ti tiger's eye. None of them move. Okay. Well, maybe we're not ready for those yet. 
What does Malachite look like? It's green. green. Okay. Do you just know that? Yeah. Okay. Good for you. I knew that before geology. I knew that from Team Four. Uh, not. <laughs> why does it Team Fortress? I knew that from Warcraft Three uh, gem tower defense. God, you played a lot of that. <laughs> then. All right. Malachite comes um, up a fair bit. It's always green. I think Malachite's one of the gems in Diablo Two with the Haradric Cube. <laughs> Maybe. Or balance the highest precision point towards the third quartz point instead towards the Malachite. When everything is set up for optimal accuracy, wind the clock up by turning the top right gear clockwise twice. Once the lid is closed, test the experiment by setting the clock to 12. This should initiate the extraction process. Okay. Um, that sounds like a lot. Yeah, this is involved. I have a bird. Uh, he seems nice. Should be, so I have a letter that I think I need to give to you. Shall we go back to the post office before we mess around with Raven's clocks uh, anymore? Well, we need to figure out how to open the the locks before I can you can give me anything. That's probably true. Let's see. Hmm. Let's go quickly do this anyway. See if it if it works. Okay, here we go. Uh, I I got a letter by giving my letter to the post office box, which isn't how mail works, but that's <laughs> fine. <clears throat> wanna, wanna head back to the post office? <laughs> <laughs> to receive your letter, you must offer a letter of equal or commensurate <laughs> value. One year, two kittens, five years. I'm trying to think if that can be input into the, the combo so I can get into the post office. Uh, so I have, I have a, the post office box number and then what appears to be the combination to the specific box number. Does that help you? Oh uh, yeah, that would be a thing. Okay. Uh, what's what number? What box is it? Twenty-eight. Oh. Um. Oh, I can scroll up and down. Okay. I was in the forties. <laughs> uh, twenty-eight. Oh. Okay. That is northwest. Okay. West. Okay. Southwest. Okay. East. Click. Ooh. It was like it was a raven's foot. <laughs> Gross. Um, and they got mail for Amelie Raven. A little on the nose to be like, I'm the person who is Raven. If Ravens follow me around, my name is Raven, and also <laughs> my combination to my P.O. box is a Raven. <laughs> it's like, okay, man. Oh, I got a key. So I can probably go break into a place now. Here's your key to the clock shop, Amelie. When you're done working, oh. could you help me look for my Raven? Lerk. So you're Lerk and I'm <laughs> Amelie. Yeah, so now you can enter the Raven's Clock Store after hours. Yeah. Let's go break into a place. By which I mean use a key <laughs> that was given yeah. to me. <laughs> on purpose. <laughs> mm -hmm. How very thievery. Oh, okay. I have a clock full of gems now. So I can okay. do the puzzle then. And I have, do you a, have, yeah, four, I have a Malachite. You have four, four slots, basically? Yep, I have a Malachite. And a tiger's eye, a quartz, and a ruby. And stop, bird. Stop it. He's pecking away at, at the that the whole thing is gonna make it fall over. I thought you were mad at me. No, there's a bird in my room. Okay. There are two. There are two birds with an all of us. <laughs> They're both annoying. One of which, one of which pecks you. The other which has clues. You're fucked either way. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> so what? What's okay. the what's the logic puzzle? Okay. Uh, the tiger's eye should be left of the quartz. Um, the malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. The ruby must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to try to solve this on my end as well. So tiger's eye is to the left of the quartz. Yep. Ruby can't be by tiger's eye. I think it goes... And Malachite can't be on the end. I don't want to spoil it, but I think I've already solved it. But I want to give you time to try and solve it, too. So 
but it's fun. <laughs> what are the clues again? The tiger's eye should be to the left of the quartz. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. Ah. The ruby must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. Hmm. So the malachite can't be on the ends or by the ruby. Mm hmm. The ruby can't be by the tiger's eye. Can you repeat him again? Sure. The tiger's eye should be to the left of the quartz. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. The ruby must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. Hmm. Well, this is annoying. So the ruby can't be by the tiger's eye, and the malachite can't be by the ruby. Mm-hmm. Does it sound like the tiger's eye has to be directly to the left of the quartz, or just somewhere left of it? Uh, somewhere left of it. That's the secret. I'm not sure how to input it, how to confirm it. Uh, <laughs> the tiger's eye is left of quartz. What well, can't be by the... Fuck, it's really hard to keep these all in my head. Uh, <laughs> the malachite can't be next to what? Uh, the ruby. And the ruby can't be next to the tiger's eye. Yeah. So I have it as, like, Tiger's Eye, Malachite, Quartz, Ruby. That's what I have. Yeah. How do I... Oh, what's the... Is there something that says how to input it? Uh, let me look. I don't have a confirmation, necessarily. But I have a spinny, I... spinny thing, and I have a thing that kind of says... Oh, uh, point the precision needle towards the Malachite. You need to stop, bird. You need to fucking cut this out. <laughs> I, uh, I'm sorry, I'm very I've, lactose I've, intolerant, but you're not going to get me I've, to I've give pointed, up my milk anytime soon. The, I pointed at the Malachi. Okay. Uh, wind, the t wind the clock up by turning the top right gear clockwise twice. That's ridiculous. Oh, it's going. Okay. Okay. Once the lid is closed... Test the experiment by setting the clock to 12. What's the clock? Uh, because it's all in a clock. Okay, we'll set it to 12. Oop! Oh! Oh! Uh, it ate the bird. That's not okay. Uh,. Maybe this is what's happening to animals? I mean, it's less serial killery than I thought. It seemed maybe they're, doing, maybe they're doing animal testing for their their time capture device that they were talking about. Yeah, that's they, definitely what they're, they're doing, and it's pursuing immortality. Yep. Okay, so it's doing like a code. Three, 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 six, three, six, six, three. That was longer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a little unhelpful. It kept, it, okay. kept, it kept seeming like it was over and it wasn't. All right. 3336363. Uh, 3336363. Three, 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 I just wrote this. Oh, yay. It's legible. I wasn't looking at the paper when I was writing it. <laughs> so I was hoping. 3336363. Okay. Three, 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 six, three, six, six, three. Huh. Yeah, it's just like tapping out a code, the the minute hand is, on those two spots. What's up with that? Can I do anything else in this I room? actually don't know. That's, that's different. 
Me. Hmm. Three 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 six three six three six three. Three 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 six three six six three. Okay, so that what? God, this game is very easy to accidentally click out of. <laughs> <laughs> um. Hmm. Okay. The yeah, only seems... thing that we still haven't done yet is the uh, is the house with like the bells. See, because yeah, we still don't have a train path. No. I think we're done with the post office. Yeah, and this is gonna be like a part two. Oh. So if I head back to the house, I guess I'll. What if I just try hitting the? No. Nope. Okay, no. it's not just easy to click out of. It clicks out of itself. If you just do something a little too aggressive without even leaving yep. the window, I think we're. I think we're. We might just be misunderstanding what to do. Yeah. And I'm looking around. I'm not finding much else. So I think my mess. My clue to give you is just what I've given you so far. That so sucks. I so I think the. I think the issue might be with interpreting your side of things. Okay. Like the like what the puzzle is. Let's see, because I'm poking around for anything else to do in this house. I think I, I kinda know. I think I kinda peaked when I got this message. <laughs> so I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like you to keep it safe for me, Lyric. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. And then we have the strangeness uh, of the threes and sixes, which sounds like a rejected Queens of the Stone Age song. <laughs> so... I, mm, hmm. I don't know, maybe there's more, more in there. It could be, like, study, office for safe, and then kitchen... Music room, front door, dining room? I'm gonna try that. Like, do you just kind of click on everything or something? Uh, yeah, I mean, I assume I need to arrange all... I, I assume I need to click on each bell once. And it has something to do with the story. But the problem is I don't... I only... I can only suss out, like, three words of the story. But can you, I feel can like you click more. on bells more than once? Yes. What if you click study once, pantry twice, dinner table five times? Uh, okay. A number of years. Study once, pantry twice, dinner table five times. That worked. Good hey. job. And now I can scroll down to the bottom. And I see we have a keg, which I can break open, it looks, if I just keep clicking on it. Take that keg. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I gained a clock. Yeah, the keg was what puked story at me. Yeah, well, it puked clock at me. That's more confusing somehow. Yep. Okay, maybe this clock, I need to set it to 333. Three, three. I'm... What the hell is this? Or somehow input the threes and sixes on it? Yeah, okay. The three... I... What the heck? What the hell is wrong with it? So the hands on this clock spin on their own. And I'm not <laughs> sure how to influence what they do. Is there a way oh, to... maybe... click or something as they pass the numbers that you want? These are probably the directions that we're supposed to train. Oh! 
So you're probably seeing what I was, you're probably seeing what I was seeing. Is yeah, like it, it so, just kind of it kind of it would it does one full cycle to indicate that it's resetting, like it's done telling uh, you the code, and then it tells yep. you directions. So the threes were rights yep. and the sixes were downs. Yep, that's exactly it. Okay. So I and then they need to transcribe from the beginning what your yep. directions are, and then we can combine them. Yeah. And yours include down, so if you you obviously can't go first, yeah, because you would go off the map. So I I go first. Okay, so that's. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna transcribe those numbers. They'll be quicker. Then I'll put it into directions. Three, twelve, 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 three, six. Let me confirm that. 12, 3, 12, 12, 12, 3, 6. Okay, got it. Got it. Let's go I'm beat this go, level then. I'm ready to get the hell out of here. It all suddenly made sense. Oh, Alright, so it. we're starting with yours. Looking out of the world. Okay, that would be up. Yeah. Ready? Okay. Right. Yep. Up. Yep. Up. Yep. Up. Yep. Right. Yep. Down. Yep. Okay. Uh, so that's the end of yours? Yep. So we're going right three times. Okay. Down. Okay. Right. Okay. Down, down. Okay. Right. Did it. And here it go. It looks like a farm or a factory. Yeah, it looks like a farm. I it see it like as a, a factory. Yeah. I'm going on to Twain. It's, it's the train that takes us to the future. 